Hello. Uh, this is my sketchbook, first sketchbook ever that I have ever done. And no, the um, cover did not come with it. It, uh, I made it actually because the first one got ripped off of there. And this is what my sister did for the um, the first page. I don't know if she asked me or if I just let her do it because I didn't really really mind her actually doing it. And yes, forgive me, this is my first vlog or YouTube video thing dingy. And yep, here we go. And some of the stuff I'm not really going to tell you because <laughs> I am, um, yeah, I just don't feel comfortable showing everybody. Wow, fail. Okay, anyway, so here we go. <clears throat> this is one of my, I don't know if it's focused. Yep, this is one of my crosses that I did. And I like Celtic crosses, so I was trying to go for that. Kind of. Okay. And... This is another one. And I do have these on Facebook, if anybody has Facebook. I don't know if anybody has Facebook. A lot of people have Facebook nowadays. But, anyway. Hopefully this isn't shaking too much because my hand is shaking just a little bit. And then there's the um, hearts, random hearts that I felt like doing. And the top one you will see later, a little bit, kind of. And I think so will be the bottom one. I'm not really sure. But anyway. <clears throat> Alright. These, some of these took me like hour or so, or day, depending on how long I felt like actually doing it. And it's not really focusing that well. Er. Okay. Well, you get the gist of it, though. It's, um... Yep. And there's this one. Like I said, Celtic crosses. Celtic anything, really. <coughs> um... And this one is kind of a, my, f oh, well, not really my favorite, but it's, um, it's, uh, anybody seen Aladdin? If you haven't, get cute, traditional Disney movie. It says, a diamond in the rough, which, um, here, I'll, I'll just go forward with myself. Okay. Anyway. But that's what it looks like. And then this is a heart that I, star that I did. <laughs> Definitely not a heart. Okie dokie. <laughs> and this one, my dad needed something during church. And um, I, uh, he goes, do you have a piece of paper that I could borrow? And I was like, yeah, sure. So I just tore that little corner piece out. And I was like, meh, I'll just um, go ahead and go ahead and... Um, <clears throat> do something on that page. And then this one, um, yeah, of course you can see what it is. It's a spider web or whatever. And then this one, I do believe, yes, I did some of these during church and then I felt really bad about doing it in church and then I stopped. <laughs> I don't know if I'm talking to it. Okay. <clears throat> Alrighty then. And skipping ahead just a little bit. Okay. And this one, I did around the time that my nephew was born. Around the time. And then I should stop saying and then. Alright, and this one. Cool little pattern that I figured. And then this one. Everybody was like, is this scales or Actually, I don't know what I was going for. I just like the design. <laughs> and this one is really cool. It's probably one of my favorites. It includes hearts and crosses and stuff. And of course, if any of my friends or family are watching this, um, I am part Scottish. So, 
as you can tell, and as by the bed spread, I'm totally not proud of my Scottish heritage at all. <clears throat> and this, and I'm also part German. Yep. I tried to shade it a little differently because the colors of the flag and stuff. <laughs> Okay, yeah, fine. And, conveniently, yes, I did say that I go to church and stuff, and I did stuff in church, but I made a Bible in church. I guess that's okay. And then I stopped, I believe, for a while, and I just kind of put it away and everything. And then I got really stressed one day, and I said, okay, it's time to get it back out. So, this is the starting of that, and then there's that one, yes, it goes from really dark to really bright. <laughs> and then, this one, I did, okay, fall, it's alright, no, really, fall, okay, <clears throat> anyway, but, yeah, and this one I did when I graduated, and I have little helpers in the background, if you can't hear them. Anyway, um, but yes, I drew this one out, and then when I got markers several years ago, I decided to actually color it. So, this is a band that I listen to, and they're from Germany, and most of these ideas I just get in my head and then I kind of have to put it on paper or they'll drive me nuts and they'll just stay in my head. <laughs> really annoying. <clears throat> Sometimes. And then this is another one. Of course I saw photos of them and everything or whatever on <clears throat> the internet and they were in camo, one of them, in one of the pictures and I was like, yeah, that's pretty cool. And I think I did cheat just a little bit with the circle cup. Somehow. Cheated. <laughs> I think I used a compass or something. And my little helpers are trying to help me talk to you guys. And this one is a local band that I... That was from here in Virginia. I live in Virginia. Um, and I helped them out and their first five cities tour was uh, and um, yeah this is it was their cover of their album I guess you would say and uh, yeah and of course yes I have read Twilight and I like Twilight you could say that and um, <laughs> I like the books better, personally, but, um, because, and I do believe, am a firm believer that, um, vampires should not sparkle. <laughs> yes. So. <laughs> yeah. And I do like, um, her, um, her description with one of the other, the little book with one of the minor characters. She... <laughs> The, one of the, those vampires described themselves as a glittering disco ball, which was very accurate. <laughs> okay, and of course, another vampire one, of course, if you can't tell by the title. Um, yep, and tried to do one of the posters fonts and design justice, but yeah. Anyway, and this one, everybody's like the scales and whatever thing again. But, um, no, this is just a random idea I decided to do. And this is chalk. This is all chalk. And I shaded it in very nicely, I think. I don't know. It depends on the person, really. And then I have very cuckoo -cu chewy little birds going off in the background. This one is, um, well, 
This one is chalk because as you can see probably from the coloring, this is chalk and then this is co crayon, very bright crayon, <laughs> neon bright crayon. And then this one is a mixture of a little bit of everybody. The, it's probably um, colored pencil and yes and again I cheated with the compass and all that stuff and highlighted it, did it, everything. And then of course Merry Christmas for Merry Christmas. So I put on my um, either on my profile picture or on my cover for Christmas for on Facebook. This is Happy New Year. Figured I'd go along with the theme. <laughs> and then this one I was doing at work because one of the ladies, one of the teachers at work had um, had uh, kites up in a room and I was just going with that. And this is my mom's camera. She let me borrow it because she's awesome. Anywho, but this is this, um, my friend did last fall, I th not last fall, a few years ago. Oh yeah, 2013. Uh -huh. Anyway, um, but another idea that just became in my head and I had to put it on paper. And, oh, okay. Um, <laughs> this one is of one of those guys right there. I don't know if you can see him. Oh, there he is. One of those guys right there. And one of those guys right there. And mommy and daddy up there. Hi! Um, this was my cuddle bug. She was, um, very, very sweet. And she was very sad when she died. So, that was for her. Um, and then this, of course, you can tell. Happy birthday. And it's got all sorts of things. It's got color pencil, paint, and really plastic bird. Um, then, of course, Happy Thanksgiving. And I also put um, this one for on my cover page for Thanksgiving. Cover page or profile. This is, uh, this was for one of the vlogger vloggers on YouTube. And they have huskies and they're absolutely positively adorable and one of them died and I decided to do a memorial of the ones that are living and the ones that um, are still alive. And I am going to resend this and redo it for them and send it to them, except for just a little bit different. Um, yes. The next one, one of the girls at school, she helped me decide on because I had the colors already and she just helped me how to rotate and and um, switch them, switch the colors out so it worked really cool. And I think it turned out pretty cool. Um, of course, brick wall. I, ruler, helpful, very helpful. <laughs> um, different colors. And next one is the one from the beginning, actually. It's the heart from the uh, beginning, the one of the little little guys. Um, except for a little bit different because, of course, it's bigger. And <laughs> I had to compromise with that. And this one is also kind of the scale, dragon scale, fish scale sort of thing. And, of course, it's chalk over on the sides and then crayon or colored pencil in the middle. And then I highlighted the lines. And this one is a movie. A really, really good movie. And um, Mortal Instruments. Of course, you probably read that. Um, and the characters are on the sides. And this one means strength. And these mean angelic. Of course, if you've seen it, you already know it. And this one is a sci-fi TV series that I watch, and um, that is really cool. And 
I actually made this gray color right here. This is actually gray. I don't know if you can really see if it's... Oh, there you go. Um, it's actually a gray color, and I made it, and I was pretty proud of myself. But this is all paint, this this whole thing, except for the wording is not paint. Um, yeah. This is, of course, The Hobbit. And this was kind of the second try for the Celtic not design and um, and of course it has this one has the movies movie titles on there and the of course the elves and humans and all that good stuff and this one is an actor he's very talented and he's a good actor and I did this for my friend and I and um, this was actually my first, um, first, sorry, oh. I had, <laughs> I had this all done, you guys, and it just kind of messed up for some reason. The video was not working out too well for some odd reason, but, um, this was actually the first dragon wing that I did, and, um, I think it turned out pretty decently. I mean, it's not perfect, but anyway. And then I imprinted it on there. And then um, there's the, also the colors of the Welsh flag. And I compromised for the Welsh flag because the uh, dragon on there looked a little um, scary. Not scary, but interesting. And Sam Hugan is an actor as well. And he's on... Um, Outlander, which you will see something for Outlander as well, and thank you, I thank you so much. I, I really needed your help. Yes, I did. Okay, um, <laughs> continuing on, and of course, it's he's from Scotland, so I did the Scottish flag and various. Sorry for the shakiness. Um, and and colors for that. And I was gonna do the do the background. Um, for the lettering blue but then I decided I like the white letter and here we go and now we have Outlander which is a really really good book and I tried to match the um, the colors with the tartan that is on the kilts that the guys wear and yeah and those the Diane is Diana, sorry, is the uh, author, and Claire and Jamie are the characters. And then, of course, we have Henry Cavill, or Cavill, or sorry if I'm murdering his name. Um, yes, and this was kind of a pain because um, some of trying to figure out how to do the little design on the inside of it and um, this is also well the gray isn't the part of it but it's um, that's the Jersey Island British Isles flag and it's the colors from it except for the gray like I said and then this is the imprint, and some of these things are not exactly the um, on the flag because the uh, little guy up there in the little uh, seal, um, he was a little more interesting looking. And if you go look the that flag up, you will see. And I could not do it for the life of me, so, <laughs> so I decided to improvise and compromise with myself. And this is Chevron. If my actually before my friend, one of my friends, she <laughs> she, um, she was like, "Well, I'm looking for a shirt with Chevron," and I was like, "I have no idea what Chevron is." And now I know what it is. And these are my two favorite colors. And yes, their paint is very very bright. Um, yes, this is paint, and it was very interesting to do. And then 
this is the last page of it. And for those of you who are still here and are still are watching, if you're not like, yay, she's finally done. Um, but this is was with marker and colored pencil, I believe. Um, yes. So, if you are continuously watching this with me, I don't know how long it is until I edit it. Um, <laughs> thank you, and if you liked it, then please like it. And I really would like to do more videos, vlogs, not daily vlogs, but um, just more vlogs with these guys. Yep, yeah, these guys. He's right there. He's adorable. And yes, of course, my sister pointed out she has a cat and she has fluffies and I have poofies. And yes, you're talking. Yes, keep talking. Yes. And the type of bird that they are is a diamond. This is a diamond dove. These guys. She is a parakeet, if you don't know that. Anyway, <laughs> she stopped talking. And this one is very strange. <laughs> And these are mommy and daddy. There you go. See them now. Um, yeah. So, and if anything, if you want to know their names, this one is Ross. And when he was, when these guys are born, you can't really tell what their um, sex is. So, I it was either going to be Rosalind or Ross. And of course, he's a boy. So, he's Ross. This one was going to be Alexander. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you so skittish? Oh, hi. Yes, peck me. It's okay. Anyway, well, this one was either going to be Alexandria or Alexander. And, yep, this is a boy because of the little crustaceans around their eyes. And he's <laughs> my goober. And this is mommy and daddy. And I did the E thing with them. I don't know why. It's Emma and Emmett. So, yep. <laughs> They're so cute. I'm sorry. I love birds. Yes, as you can see. And I'm surprised you haven't heard the, um, I'm surprised you haven't heard the wonderful creature in the other room. And maybe I can get some video of him soon. So, thank you for watching.